Well, for the first time ever, the newest iPhones do not come with two accessories in the box. Rich Demir explains it all in today's Tech Smart. Rich, good morning. Hey there, good morning to you, Raul. Happy Wednesday to you. Yes, Apple unveiled the new iPhone 12 models, and of course they have better cameras, they're faster, they also have 5G wireless, but a lot of folks are talking about what they no longer have, specifically in the box. Apple no longer including headphones or a power adapter. It's the moment Apple fans have been anticipating. Four new iPhone models, each with a speedy new 5G connection. At least that's the promise. So far those networks haven't lived up to the hype. Verizon now the latest carrier to turn on nationwide 5G iPhone 12 comes in two sizes, each with identical features. There's a new squared off design and a stronger ceramic shield screen that won't crack as easily. Magnets on the back of the phones enable an entirely new ecosystem of snap-on accessories. Apple calls it MagSafe and it will work with everything from wireless chargers to wallets. iPhone 12 starts at $699. Next, Apple's top-of-the-line iPhone 12 Pro, also in two sizes, and four colors, including a shiny new Pacific Blue. Apple says the camera is basically professional grade. The OIS on all our wide cameras this year can now make 5,000 micro adjustments per second. A LiDAR laser scanner helps with low-light focus and augmented reality. Pro models start at $999. The base model now includes double the storage. In a nod to the environment, Apple says they will no longer include two items in the box, their iconic headphones or a wall plug. Thankfully, you'll still get a USB cable. Finally, Apple taking another try at the smart home speaker. It combines precise, high fidelity sound with the intelligence of Siri. A new HomePod mini sells for $99 and acts as a smart home hub, intercom, and music player. There are podcasts and radio, but still no mention of native support for Spotify. All right, now pre-orders for some of these new models start this Friday. They'll be in stores next Friday, but some of the new models don't launch until November. Uh, you can learn more on my uh, website, richontech.tv.